So the Style Series is all about meeting Sydney's most influential and successful young females. And today we're in the eastern suburbs and we're off to meet Julie Stefania, who is the co-founder and the CEO of Style Runner. She is the quintessential girl boss. She's a trailblazer, she's an entrepreneur, and I can't wait for you guys to meet her. Hi, I'm Julie Stevania, the CEO and founder of StyleRunner.com, an online destination for premium women's active wear and athleisure wear. Welcome to my home. So my personal style is kind of minimalist um, with a little bit of a twist and usually a bit sporty. I would wear this dress to work with a pair of sneakers uh, and I'd change into a pair of heels at work and go straight to a date. My guilty food pleasure would probably be a cheese plate. This is the sort of thing I would definitely wear to the office. Um, I live in caps, I wear them with almost everything. And right now I'm absolutely loving these filler disruptor sandals. I definitely have a trainer obsession. I've got a lot, um, but I also love heels. So I guess I love shoes in general. <laughs> so this is what I normally wear to a business meeting. So it's kind of corporate up top, but always in the kicks. I'm definitely a better cook than my husband. <laughs> Right now I'm reading The Innovator's Dilemma by Clayton Christensen. Um, it's really important about how you have to continually reinvent yourself, so I highly recommend that one. There are so many Australian designers that I love. Um, right now I'd say my favourites would be Dion Lee, uh, Camilla Remark and Zimmerman. This dress is actually a Zimmerman. I love this skirt for its fullness and I love the length. It's perfect with flats or of course sneakers. Oh, if my hubby dressed me, um, I think he'd put me in something like today. Pretty casual, I think he'd be happy with me in a pair of sneakers. Text. Weird. Coffee. Wine. Maldives. Taste. Trainers. Swim laps. Alone. Abs. Truth. Mm, breakfast. Savory. Oh. Netflix, <laughs> spin, a bit of both vintage and brand new, mm, eat out, bar, mm, poached, dusk, online shop. The best coffee in my hood would be Gypsy Coffee. The market in King's Cross on a Saturday is amazing um, and I always get loads of flowers, actually where I got those from. The best breakfast would be room 10. One of the things that I know now that I didn't know as well when I first launched the business was that any enterprise is gonna take you at least 10 years. So, you know, if you're gonna start something, get ready to really, you know, kind of get behind it for a while. Best business advice that I have ever received is just focus on what's important, not what is urgent. And there's a really big difference. I still don't feel like we've actually made it. We're six years in um, and I feel like we're only a fraction into the journey. We still have so much more that we want to achieve.